A look at a full Martin Stadium in Pullman. Washington State will kick off. Oregon won the toss. They are receiving for the Ducks. Charles Nelson, the deep man. And the kickoff from Eric Powell. We're underway in the Palouse. Here's Nelson from the goal line. Nelson spun around and dropped near the 20. And that's where the Oregon offense will go to work. On first down, Brukov keeps it. He lost the football, but he was down. No fumble, a gain of four, just shy of the 25. On second down and six. The first carry for Royce Freeman, and he's bottled up, a gain of one. And they bring it. Dumped off to Royce Freeman, first down and more. And Freeman out of bounds, shy of the 40-yard line. On second down, Kruka out to the outside. It gets to Darren Carrington, and he's brought down shy of a first down. Robert Taylor out there for Washington State. Royce Freeman motions into the backfield, and it's Freeman turning the corner. Freeman, there's a penalty marker down. Big run for Freeman to the Washington State 29, but a flag in the area of holding. Holding, offense number 85, 10-yard penalty, play, third down. Third down and eight from the 40. Kruka to the outside, sliding catch is made by Charles Nelson, and it's right at the marker. Will it be enough? It is a first down for Oregon. At the Ducks, 48, Nelson goes in motion. Up the middle, short gain for Tony Brooks-James. On second down, reversing field. Darting for a first down is Tony Brooks James. From the Cougars, 40, first and 10 ducks. On second down, Freeman hit behind the line. Third and five for the ducks. Bruka, pocket breaks down, and it's incomplete. Fourth and five. Confusion on defense for the Cougs. Bruka, lost it. The deep ball, incomplete, tried to get it to Charles Nelson. On first down, the Cougs run it. And into Oregon territory, Gerard Wicks with a big game. A quick hit, River Craycraft with the catch. A handoff to James Williams. First down, Washington State. Good protection. Falk looking on the move. And he just throws it down the sideline. Looked like he was throwing it away. But it's a catch for a first down. Deep drop for Falk. Inside the 10. Falk, the crossing route. Touchdown! Game marks. 29th career touchdown catch for the senior from Venice, California. Nelson will bring it out. Nelson with a seam. Nelson to the outside. Nelson at midfield. And Nelson tripped up inside the Washington State 45. Peyton Pallor on the tackle. On the plus side of the field, Oregon begins this drive. Dakota Prukop 
Dumps it off to Dwayne Stanford. And Stanford run out of bounds, has enough for a Ducks first down. Royce Freeman down to the 20-yard line, some tough running. Freeman dropped behind the line. Hercules does it again. Hercules Mataafa. Movement up front looked like Brady Aiello, the left tackle, pulled out too soon. Let's start. Offense number 66. A five yard penalty. Still third down. Third down and 15. Back of the 25. Dakota Pruka over the middle. Farrell Brown the catch. Close to the marker. It appears he's just shy. Chopped down by Shalom Luani. Royce Freeman has the first down and more. Touchdown, Oregon. It's their personality, Roxy. It's what they do. You come in anticipating that the Ducks will go for their fair share of fourth downs, will certainly at least consider the possibility of two-point conversions. This is what the dominance of their program has been built off of. 40th career rushing touchdown for Royce Freeman. And now Aiden Schneider, the junior from Portland, on for the extra point. They spread it out. We'll see. You never know with the Ducks. And now Taylor Alley brings everybody back in. It's all about a numbers advantage. You trust the personnel on the field to make the decision. First deal, all Pac-12 last year for Aiden Schneider. And he's now 13 of 13 on the season. Tied at 7, 534 to go in the opening quarter. Caleb Fossum, Navaris Martin Jr. back to return for Washington State. The kick from Matt Wogan. Touchback, it'll come out to the 25. Luke Falk, underneath, it's complete to Kyle Sweet. And Sweet. Out across the 35, first down, Washington State. On first down, running into the line and pushing the pile forward. James Williams for the Cougars. All day to throw, Luke Falk slings it out to James Williams. Cuts it back, and Williams should have enough to move the six again for Wazoo. Jamal Morrow is the running back. Trouble with the snap. Falk unloads. First down. Kyle Sweet the catch. On first down. Gabe Marks the catch. Drags a couple of tacklers. And shy of the first down. On second down and two. Falk will run. He'll slide and get the first down. Heady play by Luke Falk. Falk dumps it off to Jamal Morrow. To the outside. Hurdles a defender. First down, Washington State. Seeing immediately where the safety valve is. Morrow going up top. Showing the dexterity to leap over Ugo Amadi. Cooks in the red zone again inside two minutes to go in this first quarter. Falk is nine of nine for 81 yards. Just haven't really seen. They've shown some potential zone blitz looks. Haven't seen it. Out of the backfield. Short gain that time for Washington State and Jamal Morrow. Gerard Wicks, the ball carrier, to the 10. Falk for the end zone. Incomplete. 
The first incompletion for Falk tonight. Falk dumps it off. First and goal, Washington State. First and goal. Let's see if the Cougs elect to run another play or take it to the start of the second. Mike Leach looked very stoic in that moment, so it would appear he's going to wait till the second quarter. First and goal at the four as we start the second. Luke Falk, 11 of 12 for 92 yards. Up the middle, powering his way in is Gerard Wicks. Touchdown, Washington State. Offensive line coming off the ball, getting ugly. Moving the line of scrimmage with extreme prejudice. And Oregon's eight game winning streak snapped last year over Washington State that double overtime thriller at Autzen. This will be a touchback out to the 25. From the 25 Dakota Pruka slings it to the outside and it's Charles Nelson stepping out of bounds shy of the 35. Second down and two. Royce Freeman a hard hit. Right to the 35 before he's pushed back. Should have a first down. Frankie Luvu there for Washington State. Play action. Farrell Brown spinning, dragging the tackler with him to the marker. Robert Taylor was hanging on for dear life there. Bubble screen. Charles Nelson. Short gain. Rukop keeps, brought down shy of midfield by Peyton Pallor. Third and six, Rukop nearly intercepted. Shalom Luani stepped into the throwing lane. Good kick. Fossum calling for the fair catch inside the 20 yard line. Luke Falk and the Cougs offense going back to work at their own 18 yard line. Falk to throw on first down. And it's incomplete and a huge hit. And there's a flag coming in as Reggie Daniels lowered the boom on Tavares Martin Jr. There is no foul. The contact is ruled legal and not late. James Williams, Jamal Morrow, the running backs. On second down, Falk. To James Williams, and he gets out across the 20. As there is movement up front. All start. Offense number 58. High draft penalty. Still third down. Third and 11. Pump fake. Falk steps up, and it's in and out of the hands of River Craycraft. Dwayne Stanford the catch. And should have enough for an Oregon first down as Marcellus Pippins on the stop. Royce Freeman, the ball carrier inside the 25. From the Cougars 16 yard line. Oregon down a touchdown. Royce Freeman up the middle. Freeman down to the five yard line. First and goal from the five. Freeman pulls his way toward the goal line. He is stopped just shy. Second and goal at the one. Freeman on second effort, he's in. Touchdown, Oregon. We 
spend time describing the yards after contact. There's defenders in position. They're doing everything in their power to try and keep Royce, Free Royce, <laughs> Royce Freeman from rolling into the end zone. Faith Pallor was in position, initially stacked him up. Freeman got a little help from his friends. Cameron Hunt came in and gave it a little, just a little tap to help him get in. Aiden Schneider to try to tie the game. And he does. We're tied at 14, 922 to go in the second quarter. Robert Taylor on the return spun down as he reaches the 20 yard line from the Washington State 20 play action for Falk under pressure and it's incomplete pressure coming right in his face from Wayne Tay Kirby the freshman from Pocatello Idaho. Falk to handoff to Gerard Wicks. The deep ball from Falk. It's there for Washington State. Kyle Sweet into Oregon territory. Gerard Wicks. All day to throw. Now he'll run. Darts out of bounds inside the 20. Gerard Wicks, James Williams, the backs. Falk steps up, throws, caught inside the 10, first down. It's Isaiah Johnson Mack. Washington State looking to reclaim the lead. Morrow slashes up the middle into the end zone. Touchdown, Washington State. That's tough duty to ask Johnny Reagan to have Jamal Morrow just screaming downhill at him with nothing but space and opportunity. There's no time to react. There is a late flag on the play. It was thrown in the corner of the end zone, way away. After the score, unsportsmanlike conduct, offense number 61, his first of the game. That 15 yard penalty would be the first on the kickoff. Short kick from Powell. As Cal handed Utah their first loss, and on the return, it's Tony Brooks James. And good field position for Oregon to start this drive. From the Ducks 42, Prukop under pressure, and he's sacked. Robert Barber with his second sack of the season. On third and long, Prukop hit as he throws, and it's incomplete. The pressure from Hercules Matafa. Ducks forced to punt for the second time. And it's Ian Wheeler launching it. And a wobbly short punt. There's a flag down. As the return man, Caleb Fossum, was hit before the ball was there. Interference with the opportunity to catch the kick. Kicking team, a 15 yard penalty. First that? Luke Falk from the pocket on the move. Darts it to Tavares Martin Jr. And it's incomplete. Slings it out to Martin. Into Oregon territory, wrapped up by Brendan Schooler, this freshman safety. Falk dumps it off. Jamal Morrow, the catch, has the first down for the Cougars. Morrow's the running back. And Jamal Morrow finds a little hole, gets inside the 40, down to the 36. Inside 340 to go in the first half. Falk. Complete right near the marker. Pass to Isaiah Johnson Mack, the freshman from Belle Glade, Florida. Luke Falk steps up, 
And it's Tavares Martin Jr. the catch. Martin dances inside the 20. Falk, the shovel pass. And it's James Williams inside the 15 yard line. Second and five. Falk, under pressure. And he goes down. Falk, good protection. All day to throw. And it's Jamal Morrow with the catch inside the five. First and goal. Into the end zone. Gerard Wicks, touchdown Cougars. Second rushing score for Wicks tonight. We'll see how Oregon plays is with 37 seconds and all three timeouts in a big hole for Tony Brooks James. He's out near the 40. As the first carry for Kanai Benoit. And that's a gain of just one. And another Oregon timeout with 25 seconds left in the half. On second down, Pruka. Incomplete. 21 seconds left here in the first half. Kanai Benoit on the draw. Benoit up the middle. Brought down. Shy of the first down. Pruka launches for Dwayne Stanford, and it's incomplete. Nine seconds remain in the half. Dakota Pruka under pressure. Racing out of the pocket. Pruka. Runs out of bounds. Aaron Carrington outside the numbers. Penalty markers down, and that is intercepted. And the interception for Washington State, but we'll check the flag as it's Isaac Dotson with the pick. Holy, offense number 66. The penalties declined. That is the end of the first half. Kickoff from Matt Wogan. The Cougs bring it out. And it's Robert Taylor who made a poor decision, brought down shy of the 15 yard line. Luke Falk throwing on first down. Kyle Sweet. Cross midfield. Rather, River Craycraft with the catch. Longest play of the night for either side 44 yards. Gerard Wicks, the ball carrier, and he's inside the 40, down to the 37-yard line. Luke Falk, under pressure. And it's complete inside the 30. First and 10 Cougs at the Oregon. 28-yard line, there's a flag down, and a false start against Washington State. False start. Offense number 61, five-yard penalty, first down. Stepping up is Falk, he'll run. And Falk takes a right turn out of bounds across the 25-yard line. After review, the ruling is the ball hit the ground. Therefore, it is incomplete pass. Third down. Please reset the clock to 12:37. Martin goes in motion. Falk dumps it off. River Craycraft the catch. Craycraft down to the 10. Fifth time in the red zone tonight for the Cougs. They're four for four. Luke Falk from the pocket, and it's incomplete. Tried to hit. Gerard Wicks coming out of the backfield is second down. James Williams. On third and goal, Falk under pressure. 
And it's incomplete to the back of the end zone. So a tough angle for the left footer Powell. This will be a 22 yard kick. Blocked. And Oregon blocks the kick. And Powell is now 0 for 4 on the season. As it was T.J. Daniel who blocked the field goal try. T.J. Daniel seemed to be the lone man standing and resting the quarterback during the first half. Now coming up huge for the Ducks D here. So after the block field goal, Royce Freeman on the first down carry, and he's gobbled up. Charles Nelson, first down, Oregon. Play action, Dakota Pruka. Out to midfield, and Dwayne Stanford the catch. And Washington State takes the football away. The Cougars have it. And Robert Taylor for Washington State. And Dwayne Stanford is slow to get up. Takeaways were the hallmark of this Alex Grinch defense last season. There. Well done by Robert Taylor putting his hat outside on the football. Actually, Darian Moulton putting his hat outside on the football. Dwayne Stanford gives it up. First down carry. It's Jamal Morrow and Morrow fights his way down inside the 10 is Brendan Schooler with the tackle at the nine. Gerard Wicks the running back on second down. Falk to Wicks out of the backfield. And Wicks pushed out of bounds at the five. First down, Washington State. Falk for the end zone incomplete. Second and goal. Into the line. And the pile pushed backward. Third goal. Fall for the end zone. And it's broken up and almost intercepted by Arion Springs. Here comes the blitz. The lob from Fall. Incomplete. Trying to get it to Kyle Sweet, who was covered by Reggie Daniels. And Oregon has held in a turnover on downs. Royce Freeman smothered. Second down and 10. Prukop under pressure. Prukop. No signal yet. Is it a safety? The officials are talking. Hercules Mataafa the pressure. Lan Clark, a referee. The really has to do with the quarterback was down prior to releasing the ball. That's a result of the safety. <laughs> Matt Wogan with the kickoff after the safety. Robert Taylor from inside the 10. And Taylor brought down as he reaches the 30 yard line. Luke Falk slings it out. Tavares Martin Jr. the catch. And he picks his way out near the 40. James Williams across midfield and Williams into Oregon territory. Falk on the move. Penalty marker is down. And Falk just unloads it out of bounds. <laughs> There are two fouls on the offense. Holding, offense number 61. That penalty declined. Intentional grounding, offense number four. The down and challenge is by the pass. Second down. Falk on second down. The screen dumps it off. James Williams. Williams, first down, Cougars. James Williams on the carry, there's a flag down. Holding. 
Offense number 60. The 10 yard penalty. You play. First down. Inside, 5.50 to go, third quarter. Underneath. And it's Jamal Morrow on the catch. On second down, Falk. On the rollout. And it's complete to Tavares Martin Jr. And Martin leans forward to the 30. Pressure coming. Falk goes down. Justin Hollins. The Darren Carrington, the return man for Oregon. End over end kick. Carrington calling for a fair catch. And he makes it after a short punt. Here's Charles Nelson on the carry, and Nelson to the outside. And Nelson gets 70 yards out to the 25 yard line. They want to go quick. And it's Royce Freeman, a big hole. Freeman to midfield, to the outside. Royce Freeman down the sideline. 75. It didn't take long. Well blocked at the point of attack. And Royce Freeman, as we've seen so frequently throughout his career, gets to the second level untouched. And from there, the speed to take it the distance. Third rushing touchdown for Freeman tonight. And a quick strike by Oregon. They're lining up for two. They've left the offense out there. And it's Dakota Pruka. And it's incomplete. Both Carrington and Nelson were there. All types of shifting up front from the <laughs> Oregon defense. And there's the dump off. And not much there is James Williams, a minimal gain. Spinning out of the tackle is James Williams. And Williams with some impressive running of his own. First down, Coops. With Jamal Morrow. Fall toward the sideline. First down, Washington State out near midfield to Gabe Marks. Here's the running play to Gerard Wicks up the middle. And he lunges forward to the 41. He gets nine. Low snap for Falk. Dumps it off. Jamal Morrow. First down, Washington State. Falk in the pocket. Dumps it off. And it's Isaiah Johnson Mack with the catch. And the freshman gets down inside the 30. Jamal Morrow, the ball carrier. And Morrow brought down. He actually loses a yard in the play. It'll be third down. Oregon stacking the line. Here they come. Falk to the sideline. And it's a first down for Washington State. Falk. And it's broken up, incomplete. Tried to squeeze that one into Isaiah Johnson, Mack. Falk under pressure. And it's caught. The Cougars run it. Wide open up the middle. Jamal Morrow touchdown. Run up and kick off from Eric Powell. Rukop on first down, steps up. Avoids the rush somehow, then is tripped up. It ends up being a two-yard gain. Royce Freeman around the left side. Cuts it back. And Freeman 
Strong run for a Ducks first down. Play action. Prukop off his back foot. And Nelson was in the area. The pressure from Hercules Mataafa. Freeman breaks a tackle. Again, the yards after contact for Royce Freeman. Third down. Brooks James in a running back. The screen to Charles Nelson. Nowhere to go. He is smothered. James Williams, the ball carrier. Big hole up the middle. James Williams, first down, Washington State. Another strong carry on first down by Gerard Wicks. Rather, Jamal Morrow with that carry. Second and three. Falk down the sideline. And it's incomplete. There's a flag. Arion Springs is looking around going, what? Doesn't like the call. Pass interference. Defense number one. A 15-yard penalty with an automatic first down. Gerard Wicks, the ball carrier, lost his helmet in the process. Rather, Morrow again. James Williams this time, and Williams keeps his feet. Touchdown! 38 yards for Williams. That's five rushing touchdowns for the Washington State Cougars. The immediacy of top gear for James Williams may be unrivaled by any other back we've seen this season. Charles Nelson. On the return, Nelson to the outside. And Nelson. 30, 20. Nelson, his second career kickoff return for a touchdown. Clean catch. And Oregon normally sets up their return where the wedge will be towards one particular side of the field. That initially set up as more of a middle return. And then the speed of Charles Nelson ends up breaking it towards the outside. It's almost akin to a great running back who presses the hole initially. That draws the defense in, and then he bursts to the outside. So they're going for two. Pruka under pressure. Throws it, intercepted. Picked off in the end zone by Jalen Thompson. The two-point conversion is denied. Matt Wogan the kickoff. Into the end zone and Robert Taylor brings it out. Tripped up as he reaches the 15. Second and seven. Cougs keep it on the ground. First down. Jamal Morrow. Play clock rolling down. Better step move in the backfield. Gerard Wicks, the running back. He wicks the reception and wicks into Oregon territory. Another Washington State first down. 35 first downs tonight for the Cougars. With an 18 point lead, no hurry. They can be deliberate. Second effort ends up a positive play. Jamal Morrow one more time. Morrow tripped up. 
up inside the five. Tyree Robinson with a touchdown saving stop. I'm having trouble differentiating at this point. Who's the spread option running attack? Because we're seeing this Cougars offense churning up yards on the ground at a level that resembles the Oregon Ducks. 281 yards rushing tonight for Washington State. So much for the air raid, I guess. It's the Coug raid. It's the ground attack. James Williams. Six rushing touchdowns for the Cougars tonight. Edge gets sealed so effectively off the inside charge from the defensive end that makes a very easy choice for Williams to turn the corner. Two fifty four remaining. Nelson is deep to return again as Powell kicks it to the other side to Brooks James. And Tony Brooks James swarmed on the return as he reaches the 15. Justin Herbert takes over at quarterback for Oregon the freshman from Eugene. And I Benoit the running back and Herbert dumps it off to Benoit who's hit immediately but keeps his feet and he gets back to the line of scrimmage. That was a big hit put on Kanai Benoit and now Benoit is slow to get up. Jacob Breland with the reception from Justin Herbert. 65 yards for Oregon inside the Washington State 25. Stepping up, Herbert throws for the end zone, tried to get it to Jalen Brown, it's incomplete. Here's a handoff to Tony Brooks James around the left side. And Brooks James still fighting forward gets down to the 15 yard line. Tony Brooks James out of bounds first down Oregon. On second down, Herbert dumps it off to Brooks James, who can't handle it. And it's third down for the Ducks. Well, let's use the Dr. Dre reference. The aftermath is next week against Oregon for Washington. Herbert on the move. Herbert running toward the pylon. He's in. Touchdown, Ducks. And the first career touchdown for the freshman, Justin Herbert. Herbert initially looks laterally. I mean, like a lot of young quarterbacks who've got wheels, makes a quick decision to run and turn the corner. And the kickoff from Matt Wogan. That sails into the end zone. And Washington State gets the ball with 46 seconds to play. And the last time that Oregon lost three straight, you got to go back to 2007. First down carry, nice push into the backfield by Khalil Oliver for the Ducks. Bring up second down, his fault still in there, but 650 plus yards of total offense. Just a, a tremendous outing tonight in front of a full house in Pullman by Washington State. Spectacular performance for the Washington State offense and for this defense the best results they put on the field their defensive line coach Joe Salabea his guys came out ready to play and as the game moved forward the defensive front of the Cougars put more and more of an imprint just keep looking at Mike Leach and thinking yo ho ho Pirates life for me <laughs> they swung their swords on this evening they did 